Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you might be in the world. This is HND with my very first video analysis of a uh, cryptocurrency. <clears throat> so here we see Bitcoin. I had previously outlined the head and shoulders pattern. It seems to have broken beyond the neckline, as I had indicated. Uh, the left shoulder can be easily identified with a peak, price peak bottom here. The right shoulder correspondingly can be identified and able to be so here. <coughs> and the head peak down is labeled as so here. I just want to take you through how I calculate the minimum target. So what I do is I take the price from the very bottom of the head peak. For ma easy math is, let's make it 400. And then corresponding point above it on the neckline, let's make it 4,350. So I'm sorry, 4,000 and 4,350. So I subtract this from that, and that gives me $350. And if that's the case, if that's $350 from bottom of the head to the neckline, then what I can do is add this value to the point where price is about to breach the neckline and that's about 4,290 so let's make it 4,300 for easy mass so add 4,300 plus 350 okay so that is how I determine the minimum trajectory pathway for the head and shoulders pattern like so so 4650 or so typically these patterns will exceed that now personally I feel this a little bit too bullish the head and shoulders is not massive but it meets the requirements price has broken above now it's bouncing around in this region a lot of times I look at the volume as well, volume, shoulder peak. The head peak is the highest in the volume. Right shoulder peak is lower. So is the left shoulder peak lower. Both are lower than the head peak volume as well. Okay, so here's a quick one. Uh, just wanted to, I'm using this more of a, as a test. Uh, if you, and I will be posting additional ones throughout the day today. Thank you. Have a good day.